Many across the nation know the love story of Pearl Harbor to be the Ben Affleck movie from back in the early 2000s. But as is often in life, truth trumps fiction. Today, Pearl Harbor and World War II veteran Sterling Kale turned 98 years old. But that's his first birthday without his wife, Victoria, who he was married to for nearly 77 years. Each week, you can find Sterling Kale at the Pearl Harbor Visitor Center, even on his birthday, 98 years since November 29th, 1921. Happy birthday! Sterling is one of these steady Freddies that comes here and signs, takes pictures with, and really shares Aloha and the Pearl Harbor story with them. Where are you from? I'm from France. He's a living, breathing, laughing, smiling glimpse into history. He's here at least once or twice a week. So it's just a vivid reminder to me that we have this touchstone of history here that we can go up and talk to him and say, hey, Sterling, what about this and this and this? Surviving the attack on Pearl Harbor was one of his many military accomplishments in a career that spent 40 years dedicating his life to service. Not only was he here at Pearl Harbor, but he then was attached to the Marines in the Guadalcanal campaign. So his story is, I said to him, there, there wasn't a bullet that was intended for you. He survived all of that. And he, uh, you know, one of the side stories people don't know is he was diving off the boats to retrieve people that were struggling or dead. Sterling declined to speak on camera today. The Illinois native married a local girl, Victoria, who passed away earlier this year. They would have been married 77 years in December. Kale did tell us the secret to his long life is his wife. He married a local girl, so he's really part of the Hawaiian community through marriage, and he's always cherished it. And to see the lays that came from all of his relatives that uh, are part of that marriage is that, you know, he loves Hawaii, and in turn, I think Hawaii loves him.